farmer's dog box. They have different bowls because sometimes they have to be separated because Justice is like not letting Liberty eat. Obviously Liberty is pretty chubby, you've seen her. Um, I like to call her big booty. She's not missing any meals, but I don't want her to have any anxiety about when she can eat. It's day four. That means it's Friday, December 4th. How are you? Um, so I'm off to a slow start, I guess. Well, I'm up. It's uh, 9 15 ish. The girls have had their breakfast, they had scrambled eggs. I did add um, the beef liver, boif foie, and they loved it. Let's see if I can get a shot over here. That is what's left. They each get one egg. Um, now they're looking at me like, Are you bothering our food, mom? Um, did you put new food in here? <laughs> so, yes, that's Cheyenne. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> um, yeah, so there you go. I um, I watched Tanya and Anne. I watched Tanya last night, which was cute. I hadn't seen her in a while. I um, either forgot that you had a lost Tanya, because I feel like I was on social media around Thanksgiving. I don't know if you posted it or not, but I'm definitely sorry for your loss. Um, I love your resilience and that you keep a positive attitude. I think it's good for everyone. So if anyone is also on the TTC journey, um, Tanya is a tubal reversal TTC sister. Um, she's got a channel, channel Tanya and Ant, T-O-N-Y-A and Ant. Um, check her out. <laughs> definitely check her out. Okay, and then, I forgot, oh, did I show you guys this yesterday? I'm gonna show you real fast. Hopefully you'll see it. This is in the way. There's so many packages going on. Ta-da! Okay. All right, there was one more thing I wanted to tell you guys and now it's poof, left my mind. Um, I have to hop on a 9.15 call, so I'm gonna go and do that. But good morning, happy Friday, how are you? Um, we're gonna decorate that tree today, yay! I remember what I was thinking. I wanted to show you guys this. So, I got the Duncan, or I just opened this. When I was talking to Tanya on her live last night, she has Starbucks. She said Starbucks come in K-Cups. She has a sponsorship coming up with um, Starbucks. So if you like Starbucks, she might be giving stuff away. So also go over there. Um, but yeah, so I just ordered these and I think I actually ordered them like um, subscription on Amazon. So now I gotta go look for Starbucks flavors. Um, there was like something that sounded like Dolce, like caramel, something, um, yeah that I wanna go and look for. So that is what's going on. Oh, speaking of sponsorship. So someone, one of you guys was like, I watched all the commercials or all the ads. Thank you so much. And you gave me an idea. Like everybody just watch the ads. Even if you don't wanna sit there and look at them, go get a cup of coffee, come back and let them play. Cause that is gonna go toward my IVF fund, for real, for real, for real. So that, and then I, um, I'm updating my um, storefront on Amazon, so I'm gonna put the link in the description box below. Check it out. All the stuff that I'm using for the house, um, it's there's a, a tab in the storefront called Penthouse. So. Um, Red Blonde Chick, you asked me about the comforter, the link is in there, um, all the like tea kettle and all that, the link is in there. Anything that I got on Amazon, the link is in there, which I got a lot of stuff on Amazon. A lot of stuff not also, but a lot of stuff. Amazon, Overstock, and the container store is mostly um, what I did. So yeah, help support the channel, help support me, help support my rainbow baby, I appreciate you. Um, especially now since I'm paying more cash than what I thought I was gonna be paying out of pocket. Um, if you could do that, that would be super helpful. No pressure, if you're busy, don't have time, I get it, it's fine, It'll, it, it's gonna be all right, girl. Um, but yeah, just if you can, why not? All right, so that's it, I gotta hop back on the call. I'm going to go to the dentist. I have a 9.30 call, once that's done, I'll hop in the shower. I think I need to be at the dentist by 11.30. Um, and then it's my final sign off. If you are thinking about IVF, make sure you get all your dental work done, like 
cleaning, scraping, whatever, because um, poor dental hygiene can lead to heart issues. So hopefully me having all these oral surgeries help stay off any issues that I might have had and my EK, my echo will be okay, but just uh, fly, as one of my colleagues used to say, instead of FYI, she would read it as fly. Um, fly, get your, get your teeth checked, girl. That plaque is not good for the heart. Um, no, no, it's not. <laughs> All right, happy Friday. <sighs> you'll be seeing this on Saturday, I think. I'm debating if I'm gonna post this early. You'll, you'll know, and then I'll be on the same day as everybody else. But do we, do we need to be like everybody else? That's, that's the internal debate. Let's think about it. We're vlogging for YouTube. You want to say hi? Like, uh, hey, how's it going? How you doing? <laughs> I just made you famous. Oh my I'm god! A famous vlogger. Okay, myself. there you go. Yeah, I'm just doing vlogmas. So, um, in December, what is your vlog? What do you vlog about? I vlog about everything. Okay. Uh, cars, life, life experiences. You know. Nice. You know, this business. <laughs> So I just got home, I'm in the package room, and looks like the girls got the farmer's dog. They're gonna be excited. the floor and 
the kitchen so that I could be down here with the girls while they open up their farmer's dog box. Farmer's dog, farmer's dog. Okay. Better for them, easier for you. I don't know what this is. Oh, cute. It's personalized. Okay. I don't know if there's one for each of them then. It, there is. This is awesome. Okay, so here it says Justice's Feeding Guide. And I had to fill out a questionnaire to get their stuff. But anyway, that one says Justice's Feeding Guide. And this one has Liberty's Feeding Guide. So that's cool. Better for them, easier for you. So I think I may have mentioned this. They're food aggressive. Well, Justice is food aggressive. She's the smaller one. And one of you guys asked me last night. Sorry, I don't have my phone, so I can't remember who asked me but someone asked me um if they're the same age they are i think it was um oh my goodness light blue girl is one who asked me they are the same age mostly justice is five days older than liberty so justice was born may 8th and liberty was born may 13th um they're both tauruses anyway this is frozen so it comes in here it says somewhere on there there's dry ice uh, this insulation is biodegradable, well, that's good, so they're not hurting the environment. Anyway, so their names are on it, so that makes it easier. This has Liberty's name on it, and it has um, its directions. Feed Liberty a quarter pack per day, packed with love on November 30th. A hashtag long live dog, so I'm probably gonna put this on IG. So there is, and then there's this bag. So getting them in the freezer is going to be a whole other dilemma, but that's okay. We're going to figure it out. Um, pork recipe for Liberty and beef recipe for Liberty. I love that it has their names on it. Too bad they can't read. Or can they? Okay. Justice's pork recipe. These are freezing. I know. I know. Of course they're freezing. Whatever. Um, so there's a bunch of stuff in here, basically. Liberty gets a turkey, pork, beef. Justice gets a turkey, beef, and beef, and, oh wait, there's more over here, okay, so they each get four, and then it's a quarter pack per day, they each get four, and it asks you questions, like, are they omnivores, are they uh, carnivores, so there's a mix in here, it just, it's called, um, feed within four months so these should last a while so that's good i'm excited i just ordered them more you can't see it up there i use this other one so um i was saying they're justice is food aggressive so she's the smaller one even though she's the older one so she's more of the alpha and so she will growl at liberty i mean you guys heard her growl before she's just bossy with liberty especially around the food and so that's why they have like separate feeding bowls i know you guys have seen that like normally you'd have one water one food they have a water canister over here and they have different bowls because sometimes they have to be separated because justice is like not letting liberty eat obviously liberty is pretty chubby you've seen her um I like to call her big booty. She's not missing any meals, but I don't want her to have any anxiety about when she can eat. And so she barks at Justice really to tattle on her so that I can come or Cheyenne can come and intervene. Um, Liberty has been barking for, I don't know, she's six months. She's probably started barking at three months. Um, it was squeakier before, but now it's a bark bark. And then Justice just started barking about a week ago. It's a very high pitched bark and she doesn't do it as much um, yet. I think as she gets more used to it, she'll do it. But because she wasn't barking, she does this like really guttural grrr. And um, Liberty's like, did you hear that? Did you hear that? Come get her. So she'll start barking. Anyway, so I'm excited um, that they'll have this. I did, like I put in the clip this morning, I put the, um, the beef liver on there and that helped Justice eat. So um, even though Justice is food aggressive, she's a slow eater and she doesn't eat a lot, which is true of Yorkies in general. Um, but so I have given her the appetite stimulant dog food. Um, she gets this other NutriCal stuff. Let's see. Um, this stuff, which is high calorie. Um, to help her keep her weight and I have a scale and I weigh them so she's less bony now but definitely her weight has to um, be watched and I know you guys were like are those is that baby food and cereal for the dogs it is because they are low do uh, small dogs their blood sugar can drop and Justice has had a seizure once and it scared the bejesus out of me so I just make sure that she has um, the sugar that she needs so her blood sugar doesn't drop because 
that is not I, that's not how I see things ending with her so I don't want that to be um, but she had that one scare and so we're, we're pretty mindful of it now um, anyway I'm excited that they have these um, as you see we feed them whole food so this is meant to be like nutritious delicious and healthy so we'll see hopefully they like it I'm gonna show you guys this really quickly because I noticed it as I'm getting ready to put this away you see the sizes are different they did it based on the girl's weight so Liberty is bigger so she has more food Justice is over here. She's obviously smaller, so she has less food. I like that. So it's portioned properly. Yeah. We'll keep you posted as this goes on. All right. Talk to you later. Bye. The official lighting of the tree. So we don't have a topper. I don't know where the angel is. We might get a star. We're gonna look for the angel tomorrow. But it's up. The base came. I'm excited. Merry Christmas. Is that you? Can you see you? You're like, whatever, whatever. All right, so the tree is up. Yay! Um, there's some little things I want to do with it. Like, I think we need smaller lights. This is the smallest tree we've had. And so, I think I said that. We usually get like six feet tall trees. Um, I think actually the last one was eight feet. But anyway, um, this is safer for the girls because they can't reach it, although they've, you know, interested and in, involved with the balls, but they can't get to them. So, and it smells good. Yay! A little bit of normalcy in the middle of a move is always helpful, right? Right? In the middle of a move and a pandemic and Kansas and all that other stuff that happened in 2020. Yeah, so, yay! Um, all right, I think I'm gonna end it there. I was going to do the breakdown of unpacking between now and the 31st, but I'm gonna work on that tonight. I'm gonna end here so I can edit this, get it posted, and I'm not up all night. Um, I'll work on that tomorrow. And actually, I think tomorrow's just gonna be a day of like self-care. And I think organizing is part of self-care, right? It helps with the mental part of like having things in boxes in a good, um, in a time box, when it's gonna start, when it's gonna end. I'm going to get uh, the IV I'm getting, I think it's called like super cleanse or something cleanse. I'll take you guys with me. But it has the glutathione, the vitamin C, and uh, rehydration because I have been dry. I'm trying to rehydrate myself, but the, the coffee is not helping so um yeah we're gonna do that and i hope you guys had an amazing friday i'm looking forward to seeing you tomorrow um if there's anything else going on uh let me know down below talk to you later bye mm -hmm. baby does too us all